Hey guys, JT Kills are here, and this is Terraria, and this is my first ever moon, which is when uh, the enemies, I think they become more powerful, and the zombies can break down the doors and things like that. In, in this instance, I don't actually get any zombies breaking in, but I do defend it quite well, and find out how to make arrows, which is probably a simple thing which you should have known before, but I did just find out it's stone and sticks and then I make flame arrows of them because I've got so many torches I killed loads of slimes and I'm trying out different uh, ways of killing the enemies here then um, there's one way which is where I'm on the first floor where I am now the first section bottom ground floor whatever you want to call it I just wait for them all to group up and I close the door and then I'll use my sword and I'll take them all out in groups because when I'm using I think I'm using the short sword it can uh, like attack groups of enemies all at once but to start off with I'm just using this powder you see here I can take out four of them in a matter of seconds but I do run out quite quickly because the other moon I don't know if it lasts longer as well I don't know if it's a longer night but I'm trying to take this one apart I think I'm probably wasting the powder just taking out this eye but I'm trying to take out the eyes as well to get the lenses I've got seven lenses so far well at the end of these videos it's a two part this is and um, once you get ten lenses you can make a suspicious looking eye and that summons a monster of some sort, so I think it summons a big eye thing. So I'm going to get geared out for that, and then I'll record me doing that. My Let's Play series will continue. I'll upload a video later today, or maybe tomorrow. We'll see how that goes. And um, this is my room that I built on the side. This It was originally because I mucked up with a wall at the back where it overhung, and it didn't look good. And I found I got enough uh, silk from spider's webs to make a bed. So I put a bed in there, and then you can place your spawn point there. You just uh, left click on it, I think, right click on it, and it changes your spawn points. So whenever you die, you just spawn in. I'll spawn in this room, and I've now got a platform there which I can shoot through, but I won't fall through, and the enemies can't get me. And as enemies run parallel to you most of the time, as you can see, the zombies aren't hitting the door, so I ain't got to worry about the door being broken into, and I can shoot down without like being hit, attacked, or losing any health. I do die once in this ever moon, but that's quite a bit later on. I'm just taking out this guy with my sword. I'm, I'm doing five damage about a second, so probably probably ten damage a second. And I'm trying to keep. I'm trying to take out all the zombies just for coins and just to stop them breaking in. But I'm not wanting the eyes to get in because they are quite difficult to kill uh, in confined spaces because they hit 18. And see, zombies are hitting 13 on me at the moment. I've got 140 HP overall. At the moment, I'm probably on about 120 because I found two uh, life heart things. And later on in this video, I also do get kitted up because I found I'm just making some silver bars and bronze bars now. I've got three, sil three silver, one iron, and then I make loads of co copper. All that you see there is copper. I'm just getting it all now. I, don't, I forgot how many bars I finish up with. There we go, that's 67. So that's going to make me quite a lot of stuff. I don't use it yet. I'm um, to keep my health back. I'm using mushrooms and uh, a low health potion. I think it's called that heals a hundred HP, and the mushrooms heal twenty. And there's about a um, delay timer of about twelve seconds. I think it is maybe ten to twelve seconds for them. So if you eat the mushroom, you don't have to wait ten, twelve seconds before you can use it again. I suppose it makes it a little bit more difficult, but. I basically just keep on doing the same thing here, letting them in, killing them with the swords, making sure the eyes stay out if I can. But the only way I die in the end is by one of the eyes getting in, which kind of annoys me. But I've got my helpful guy just sitting in the second floor, just helpfully doing nothing, which is really good. I'm really glad I built a room for him, to be honest. Yeah, I'm gonna do a video on all how to get all the NPCs. And that's nurses, gun dealers, demolition people, guides, merchants, and all that stuff. I'm waiting for a merchant at the moment to arrive because I've got, I think I've got about 80 or 90 silver, which is quite a lot, I suppose. But then I was doing some uh, little research earlier, and there's this slime called Pinky. It's a really small slime, but it's got 150 HP, and it can drop 90 silver coins or more, which is a pretty a lot, especially because it does about five damage every time it hits you and you could even kill it with a uh, pickaxe, just a copper pickaxe that you start with so to say in the first day if you find one of them, even though they're quite rare 
and you get 90 gold, 90 silver to start with. You've got a merchant maybe second or third day, so that's quite good. I will be releasing that guide also sometime this week. And if you guys have got any questions about items that you want to know how to find and all that stuff, then I will show you. I'm uh, while I'm not recording, I'm searching through mines and that, looking for different items. I found some sapphire, but I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that yet. I'm trying to limit my use of guides and just make them for you guys. Um, two sapphire so far, so I'm thinking I need three sapphire, uh, sapphire for a bar of sapphire bar. And I don't know about to make with that. I'm not sure yet, but I'm quite close to the suspicious eye. I'm going to kill three more. Uh, demon eyes hopefully and they'll drop three lenses and then I'll be able to make it and I might just summon it just for lols and then I'll probably die or I might get geared up first and in some videos you can see so like some of the videos by the developers demon logic you can see they've got uh, like guns in some of the videos